hey guys welcome you all and welcome back to my channel this is your girl Absa. if this is your very first time here please consider subscribing to be part of this wonderful family and also hit the notification bell so that you don't miss any of my uploads if you are a returning subscriber thank you so much for coming back so guys in today's tutorial i've created a simple look for you guys if you like to know how i achieve this look stay tuned and watch till the end guys i'm going to prime my face with uh the milk hydro grip primer i'm applying the primer all over my face my teasing area and the rest of my face as well okay guys for my today's foundation as usual i'm going to be mixing this um two face bondage this way foundation and i'm in the shade chai and the huda beauty foundation in the shade mocha and i'm going over with um my Kiko Milano flat brush to apply the foundation. Alright guys, to blend the foundation, I'm going to be using um, my Morphe X Chocolate Hill. Guys, I feel like I do not have uh, the coverage. I'll be going back in with um, my Too Faced foundation and add one extra pump. Okay guys, for contouring, I'm going to be using the Fenty Beauty Mask Stick in the set Espresso. I'll be swatching like the contour at the back of my hand then apply it so guys i'm going to be blending the concealer with my 04 angle brush from sephora guys i'm going to be starting the blending on my jawline So guys, going in for highlighting, I'm using the Too Faced Bond This Way Concealer in the shade Butterscotch and Warm Sun. I'm going over with the shade Butterscotch first. So guys, I've let the concealer set for a little while and I'm going to start blending the concealer with um, a Dawn Beauty Blender and this Beauty Blender is from Beauty Blender. And make sure you flip your nose like this so that the product can get in. To blend uh, my nose um, contour, I'm using um, the loose crisps from Real Technique. Guys, 
guys I'm highlighting in a corner of my eyes with the shade warm sun and guys at this path we are going to be blending but not over blending we're going to make so that this concealer stays only the inner corner of my eyes before setting my highlighting area i have to make so go back in with my foundation brush to make so everything looks nice and flawless and also to avoid some line of demarcation in between the contour foundation and the concealer. To set my highlighting area, I'm going to be using the Huda Beauty Easy Bake Loose Setting Powder in the shade Blondie. Guys, as you can see, I'm going over in with a slight layer of powder to press the powder into my skin. Guys, I'll be going over in with the Laura Mercier Translucent Setting Powder. Guys, I do not bake for so long. I'm gonna quickly dash off the excess powder. All right, guys. I'm going to be bronzing my face as you can see my face looks so powdery to warm up my face I'm going over in with the um, Morphe bronzer in the shade Tribalizer Alright guys, to apply some bronzer on the, my nose, I'm using the Mofi E17 brush. Guys, this brush is so amazing. For something like this. And I'm using a um, small fluffy brush like this just to you know to make so you don't have that harsh line. Guys, I'm going to be applying some blush and this blush is from Milanin in the shade Red Vino. So guys, I'm going to um, do a reverse contour. And I'm going to apply some powder on the tip of my nose, like so. So guys, I'm going to cover up my smile lines. Guys, to do my brows, I'm going to be using um, the Benefit Brow Pencil in the shade number 5. 
fiesta, vámonos de fiesta. Desde que te vi, buscaba una así. Desde que te vi, buscaba una así. Guys, I'm going to be cleaning underneath my brows with the Fenty Beauty Concealer in the shade 385. Alright guys, I'm going over with my foundation to clean guys I'm going to be using the Pilly Base Rumo 4 as my eye primer and I'm using the Real Technique Expert Concealer Brush to blend the primer Alright guys, uh, for my today's eye look, I'm going to be using the Juvia's Play Zulu palette. I'm going to be first picking up this light orange. Alright guys, I've used um, orange color as my transition, so I'm going to be using um, my movie X Jeffree Star eyeshadow palette and pick this deep brown color. And I'm going back in with um, the same color to, to blend the edges. guys I'm going to be picking up this color I really want to smog it you know so guys I'm going back in uh, with uh, my brush to blend the edges so guys I'm going back in with my Zulu palette and I'm gonna pick this rose gold So guys, I'm going to be picking this pink color with my MAC 42S Synthetic Brush. Guys, I'm going to pick this brown color to smooth out my lower last line. That's okay, she's on my bed playing video games. I'm watching her over my shoulder. Guys, I'm using my MAC Liquid Last 24 Hours Waterproof Liner. To draw my waterline area, I'm using the Fenty Beauty Eyeliner. Yeah, this is the, um, the white one. I'm going to be using another MAC Skin Finishing Powder in the shade Dark Deepest.
and guys I'm using my MAC NC40 powder to set underneath my eye again Guys, I'm going to set my entire face with the Morphe Continuous Setting Spray. Guys, I'm going to be applying some mascara and this mascara is from MAC. Alright guys, I'm going to be applying highlight. Guys, for today's lipstick, I'm going to be applying the Oma Beauty Bodies Icon Lipstick in the seed Alta. Guys, I'm going to line my lip with Chestnut by MAC. Guys, I'm gonna apply my Fenty Beauty Clear Lip Blush. Guys, this is the end of the tutorial and thank you so much for watching. If you like my makeup, give this video a big thumbs up. Comment down below, it helps me a lot. I love you all and I will see you guys in my next tutorial. Bye!